FIU Sports has had a busy fall. We begin with the women's basketball team, which they have had a shaky start to this season, losing their first game, but now they go head-to-head -head with Bethune-Cookman University. The girls had a good start in the first quarter, keeping the game close. It seemed like the crowd was the sixth man on the court, cheering them on. Unfortunately, at the beginning of the second quarter, things took a left turn. FIU had 23 turnovers throughout the game, which helped the Wildcats come out on top. This is what Coach Tiara Malcolm had to say. Um, just It was a, a disappointing effort on our end. Um, I think that the extra effort plays, we didn't get to loose balls, we weren't fast enough to them. Um, defensive rebounding, we didn't do it. They had way too many offensive rebounds. And then you talk, you look at the turnover stat, um, we weren't even being pressed or anything like that. And we were just, just turning the ball over. So, you know, when we move the ball, when we reverse the ball, when we share the ball, um, we tend to get clean looks. It was a tough loss for the women's basketball team. The final score was 77 Wildcats, 59 Panthers. Luckily, it's only the beginning of the season and they can start to turn things around and start winning. The ones who are having an amazing season are the men's soccer team, losing just one game throughout their whole season and qualifying to the NCAA tournament. Now they look to get out of the first round and into the second one facing University of Nebraska Omaha. This is what a fan had to say about this game. They're a phenomenal team. They've had an amazing record, amazing season. And just because of that, I feel like they're going to have like a good game today and bring, bring us to another win. And he wasn't wrong. FIU went to win the game with one goal in the first minute by Deshaun Nenhard and a free kick from Paul Marie to Jordan Machado, who headed in for the second one of the night. FIU moves to the next round of the NCAA tournament. It's Deshaun Nenbard. What a start to the tournament. That serves it up. Near post. Back of the net. Goal FIU. Paul Marie. The final score was FIU 2, Omaha 0. In other news, the football team has exceeded expectations under new coach Butch Davis with a record of 7-4. They are on their way to a winning season and will play the bowl game for the first time since 2011. I'm Julian Barbosa for Breakfast by the Bay. Back to you guys in the studio.